All right, ladies, you ready to get this thing started? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much, Keisha, for having us all over. I'm super excited to show y'all some of the best of our relationship products that we have. So first things first, let's start off with little packets here. I'm actually going to walk you through what's in these. So you should have four things in each of your packets. First, you should have a pen on top, and then you're going to use that. Ladies, go ahead and fill out just the front of that Let's Connect card. I need your information before I can't read your handwriting. So as you're filling that out, let me tell you a little bit about myself. My name is Ashley, and I am going to be your Romance Enhancement Specialist for today. So I've actually been in this business now for six years. And just like you guys, I was sitting at a party. I was watching the girl do her thing, and I was like, you know what? I'm having fun, she's having fun. This would be something fun to do. So let me tell you where I was at when that started. So I was working at a bank full time and I had a little one at home. I had a six month old newborn. So a little bit stressful situation. I also was someone who experienced some of that postpartum depression. Does anybody have kiddos here? Not yet. Not yet? <laughs> Maybe someday. All right, so that postpartum depression can be kind of serious. And you know what? I need something fun, a positive outlet. And I just wanted to be Ashley. I didn't want to be a wife. I didn't want to be a mom. I didn't want to be a coworker. So I thought, you know what? Let's give this thing a shot. And I simply just did this to get out of the house, do something fun, and do something for me. Now, I actually have four kiddos at home. So I went from one to four. Products work, right? right? Be careful. <laughs> and oh. I know, right? Super fun. Um, and so now I actually get to be stay at home with them and party with you guys by night, which is very awesome. One of my favorite things is that I have a very flexible schedule, but also I get to be a significant financial contributor to our family. And that really fulfills me in all different aspects of my life. So that's a little bit about me, but it's time for me get to get to know y'all just a little bit. You should have a wish list there, okay? Now that's going to be our primary sheet of paper. Also, the catalog is simply just for the backing of that to make it easier for you to write. I'm not going to walk you through that. I'm going to show you what I know are the best of the best products and leave the catalog to feature anything else, all right? So take out that wish list. Flip it over on the back side for me. At the bottom, you're going to see a picture of my family. And I'll tell you again a little bit more about me. I know, aren't they so cute? Now, uh, one, two, three, and four. We're going to play a little game. Number one, write down what is your least favorite food? Like, what is that food that you hate? Hate. Grosses you out. Number two, tell me in detail what do you hate about that food? Right? I think it's something I'm like, mm -mm. write that down. What creeps you out about that? Number three, tell me if tomorrow was your perfect day, you had no obligations, no work, nothing to do. How would you spend your day? Do you have a favorite activity? Do you have a favorite hobby? What would that be? And lastly, number four, tell me why you enjoyed that so much. Why does that make you happy? What do you love about it? Now, as y'all finish up here, I want to tell you a little bit about how this process is going to go today. I'm actually going to start with some sexy little lingerie. We're going to move into our bath and beauty line, do a little foreplay and lubricants, and of course, we're finishing with the toys. I know that's what you're most excited to see. Now after that, what's really cool is I actually have products on hand with me today. So we will do private shopping one-on-one. -on -one. So you can ask me any questions that you want. You don't feel comfortable right in front of us here. But also, you get to take the products home today. There's a $7 convenience fee on every order. Why? I've prepaid for those items to go home with you. Now should I need to ship you something in addition to what I don't have? Um, that'll get to you within two weeks and it's no additional charge. Don't worry. It doesn't look awkward, right? There's no phallic shapes on the outside unless you want me to draw one and then I'll draw you something fun. <laughs> Is everyone finished with one, two, three, and four? Yeah. Awesome. Cross out number one. That one was gross. <laughs> Replace it with oral. O-R-A-L. <laughs> <laughs> and then cross out number three. I know that was so fun, but you know what? This is even more fun. <laughs> Anal. Write it down. A-N-A-L. What the heck? <laughs> Just wait. You guys kind of just filled out a Mad Lib and you have no idea what's going to happen. So, <laughs> oh I gave you all naughty nicknames at the beginning and we are going to go around and introduce yourselves and you're going to say, my oh name gosh. is, and your naughty nickname, you guys know it's coming, right? Oh. I hate oral because of number two and I love anal because of number four. Wow. So, my beautiful <laughs> hostess, will you get us started, my dear? Oh, no. Sure. My name is Kinky Keisha and I... Hate oral. Hate oral because it stinks. Ooh. 
right. and <laughs> I love I love anal because I love making it spa like. Ooh, oh <laughs> little relaxation in the back door area. I dig it. Oh All right, my dear. Oh, yeah. and I see my name tag name. Yes. Oh gosh, my name is Creamy Kristen, okay. and I hate oral because I don't like the ketchup on top. <laughs> 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 and I love anal because I love the wind blowing in my hair. Woo! Uh, it's a beautiful day outside for anal. <laughs> All right, you're next, sweetheart. Oh my god. Hi. My name is Manhandle. <laughs> my name is Manhandle Me Michaela. <laughs> and I hate oral because it's sour. Ooh. Oh. Um, but I love anal <laughs> because it's a complete escape. Ah, uh, <laughs> yes. Take you to your happy place. <laughs> okay, my name is Bang Me Brianna. I hate Earl <laughs> because it's overrated and <laughs> right, I so love right. anal because it's home to me. <laughs> Okay, well, you know what happens at her house today. <laughs> All right. Oh, fantastic. Like home, okay? <laughs> oh, wow. Well, it's nice to meet all of y'all. Um, now, do me a favor. Go ahead and flip over this wish list. On the front side, you are going to see small versions of just about all the products we are going to run through today. Anything that appeals to you, I want you to mark it off. Heart, star, penis, horseshoe, right? Draw me whatever you want on there. Um, this is really going to be for you. So again, anything that appeals to you, go ahead and mark that off. We're going to do a little raffle at the end. So when you have 10 items marked off of your wish list, you're going to yell, I want to have an orgasm tonight because um, who doesn't, okay? And uh, you're actually going to get 10 more tickets. So other ways that you're going to get tickets are asking questions, answering questions. Also, if you're familiar with any of the products, tell me what you love about those products. Sound good? Perfect. Who are my party virgins? Who has never been to a party before? Ooh, ooh. Well, y'all be sacrificed at the end. Now, the rest of you are naughty girls. You guys are going to get two, and my naughty girls get one. Yeah. Yes. All right. So. Since it's a few of you, are, it's your first time at a Pure Romance party, let me tell you just kind of a little bit about how th this company got started. So we were actually started out just outside of Cincinnati. It was a single mom with four kids, and she really knew that she wanted to provide a better life for her family. And so she started this hustle and grind of actually inviting women over, giving them a safe space to explore their relationships, explore their bodies, and get some sexual health knowledge. And that's exactly why we're here today. So you guys are going to laugh, you're going to learn something, and you're going to feel empowered when you leave here to try new things in the bedroom. Just like I told you, I was sitting just in the same seat at my second party when I was like, you know what, this would be something fun to do. So I encourage you to watch me throughout the show and see if this is something you could ever see yourself doing. And at the end, you'll have the opportunity to ask me any questions. Sound good? Awesome. All right. So look at the top of your wish list there. You're going to see a bunch of our lingerie and sleepwear. Fun part of being my hostess, Miss Keisha, is, <laughs> girl, I need you to pick a model to come play with me because we're going to have somebody model some lingerie. Michaela's mm, got it going. Woo! On. I know. She looks hot. <laughs> all right, girl, do me a favor. Put all your stuff down, and then you're going to come right up here with me. I think I got the perfect piece for you. All right. Everybody give her a round of applause. Yes! <laughs> all right. She's going to look amazing. Now, the thing that I love about lingerie, I'm actually going to hand this to you, and I'm going to have you go ahead and just slide this right on top of your clothes, all right, okay. is that lingerie is something that you do for you. It's not something that you're going to do for a partner, right? Typically, most women have that mindset, but we get feel a little insecure. You're like, ooh, right, that's kind of see-through. I can see all that. You're right. Oh, so what we tell ourselves, <laughs> that's okay, girl. This is why we're figuring <laughs> out now. Right, always is. Listen, okay, because you walk in the bedroom and be like, have it on backwards. Nope, that's what we're going to figure out right here at the party. So I want you to pick something. Do you want a hand? I do. Yeah, I got yeah. you, baby. I usually don't put my lingerie on uh, in my heels. I know. Well, you know what? What? You don't put lingerie well, on in your heels? Well, I the heels second. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's my girl. Yeah. <laughs> so here's the thing, right? You probably can pick apart your body. You might see all the flaws that right, you tell yourself. But the thing about it is, that's not true. When you walk into the bedroom wearing something like this, 
they're going to be like boobs and butt and I get to play with it. <laughs> they don't see the stretch marks. They don't see the rolls. Okay, I'm going to help you out here, girl. But well, hold on. Am I all hold on. You are. Yep. Hang on. I'm coming in. Okay. okay. Yep. We are now officially like at that Do level. you come with the lingerie? Yes, I help you the whole <laughs> way. <laughs> All right, so I've got several different shapes and sizes for all different bodies, okay? And so I, anything that appeals to you, I want you to mark this off. This is absolutely one of my favorites because it's a bodysuit, okay? You can actually wear this little bralette underneath this and pair this with her jeans that she already has on. You can wear this out, girl. Nice. Uh, mm -hmm. So you got a little black and silver. It does not matter what size the breasts are, okay? Big or small, no big deal. It's lingerie. Okay, you're not wearing it to church. Now, I also enjoy that it has a high-waisted feature about it. High waist, super in, but also if you have a little pooch in the front, right, it's, it's going to suck it in and it comes right over the muffin top on the back side. Now, do me a favor. Turn around. We got to we gotta adore that booty. Woo! Look at that high cut. Yes. <laughs> now, it's also going to have an adjustable neck tie. So if you're someone who's short like me, when you wear a one piece, right, you got the straps falling off. And if you're someone who has a long torso, super tall, you got like permanent camel toe. Okay, that's not oh. cute. Not uh, Right? The other thing about a one piece, I'm like, you're trying to have a little fun time and well, you gotta pull it to the side or take it all off. <laughs> right? Snaps in the crotch, girl. Easy access and you don't even have to do anything. All right, give her a round of applause. She can take that off. Great job, Miss Manhandle Me Michaela. Now I'm gonna pass around a few others, okay, because I want you to feel, I'm gonna add those right to your pile. Thank you so much for being one of oh my, my God, models. You got three more, girl. You are so welcome. Up next is going to be your Twilight. I'll take that when you're done. Thank you. So Twilight is going to be one of our most popular pieces for a few reasons. Most ladies love a good black lingerie, right? They're like, ooh, it's going to cover up. It's going to make me look slimmer, feel sexy. This is going to be very multi-purpose because you've got a black little baby doll. So it, a baby doll fit is where we like to kind of start. It's great for every woman, especially if you're insecure about that midsection area. It fits the breast and just flows right down, not going to accentuate anything you don't want to accentuate there. So black, low back, crisscrossing. Guys, it comes with a robe. This is a super soft robe. Okay, you could wear this as a kimono going out. It's great as a swim cover up in the summertime. And you get the matching thong with that. There's also a sexy little tie around the robe that might be good for blindfolds, tying somebody's hands down. So I want you to go ahead and feel this. I'm going to pass these around. If you'll just collect them for me and I'll grab them from you at the end. Sound good? Mm -hmm. Perfect. This dark purple color is going to look great on everyone. So it's another baby doll fit, but looks very different. It's what we call our peep show. I adore the little paisley lace right here in the breast. It's very soft and delicate and feminine. Now it's gonna have a similar top than what you saw on Miss Michaela here. You're gonna have straps that make sure it stays right on top of the nipples, okay, and stay right on top of the breast for you. Guys, this is the softest fabric you are ever going to feel. You're just gonna wanna like rub it on your face, okay? Don't do that because we're wearing makeup today. But uh, it's gonna be something you aren't going to wanna take off. It's almost like instant foreplay. When you put something on, it makes you feel so good. You're like, <laughs> dang, I'm sexy, okay? That's gonna be, that might be your reaction and that's totally cool. So mark these off if they appeal to you. Again, this is my third baby doll I'm passing around. This is going to be what we call our blush. Super delicate super feminine, that hot pink. If you have a male partner at home, they're going to go wild over the pink because it's still feminine, but it's still spicy. Double layer here, and this one has a bra hook clasp in the back. It also is great if your person at home likes the little booty, so it's gonna drape the booty perfectly. Comes with a matching thong, I'll be honest y'all, okay? I like the thongs and all, but you don't have to wear them. That way you can leave it on the whole time. I hear people say like, oh, it comes off in 30 seconds. Don't wear the thong. Just keep going, going, hop where you need to go. <laughs> All right, another one piece. Okay, this is a true story, are you ready? So I wasn't sure about this when I first got it in. I was like, I don't know. Then I put it on and I was like, oh my gosh, this hits me in every curve possible. It doesn't look, or it doesn't look like it might have the best support, but it actually in the back is going to pull up and pull back. So if, especially if you have larger breasts and you're like, Girl, I need something with underwire. No, you need this because it is going to be like mm, instant lift. And you've got this really sexy cleavage in the front. Fun fact, all right, I actually took a picture, a tasteful picture of this, of myself in this, and then my husband's grandma got it. <gasps> she was like, Ashley, you look great. I need one of those. 68 and sexy. <laughs> 
Yes, yeah. Now on the back side here, you're actually going to have very high cut. This one's going to have a, a little bit more of a thong type instead of that high waisted, and you're going to have the rock class for you. Very soft and sexy. It's going to be almost that same material as the uh, purple one, but going to be the, uh, that's what we call our Mulan Rose. Okay, so Michaela, you said something when you were getting dressed. You're like, this always happens with lingerie. If you think lingerie is hard, you need to take home this piece. This is easy breezy, girl next door sexy. Bralettes are super in, okay? And the color is going to look dynamite on every skin tone. It's called woke up like this. No hooks, class, super easy. And these are actually what I like to call the sisterhood of traveling pants panties because stretch. I'm like, oh. I know it doesn't dig into my sides, doesn't call any, cause any rolling, and they're cheekies, okay? Does that need an explanation? Everybody likes their booty hanging out. It's going to make it look nice and round. <laughs> so it comes in sizes small through 3 and 4X, so we're going to have something for every body shape and size. Go ahead and mark those down, anything that appeals to you, and that's actually going to count toward your 10 items. All right, so can you imagine, right, we just picked out some sexy little lingerie, and you need to get ready for this fun little night that we're going to have, because you said it stinks, right? Like, uh, whoa, we got to make sure that we smell good, feel good. Uh, so we're actually going to roll into some of our Bath & Beauty items. Underneath the lingerie on your wish list, you're going to have four dots. Those are the four different scents that we have available for you. So you're actually going to cross off a product that you like, and then you're going to look at the scents. If you like the scent, put a heart. If you don't, make an X. It's going to make it way easier when we get to the shopping room. Now, does anybody love coochie? How many coochie lovers? Yes. yes. Oh, what do you all? Yes. Oh my gosh. How? That makes me feel so insecure if I ha I'm walking right, trying to roll in the bedroom. Yeah. And you're like, Sexy lingerie, crotch full of razor bumps. Like, <laughs> no. So what do you love about it? I love how good it smells. It smells amazing. My coochie smells so good too. <laughs> <laughs> we can uh, leave here all having the same smelling coochie. It's awesome. Now, so let me tell you what this does. You mentioned, right, no razor bumps. It has a fun name, but this is going to be our rash-free shaving cream. This stuff is dynamite. So it actually is going to condition it, the hair and the skin so that it's very easy to remove that skin. Let it sit on the skin for about 30 seconds to a minute before you shave it off with a clean razor. Now, I'm going to pass this around because I want you to smell it. This is what we call our sweet fantasy. Okay, so give this a smell. If you like this scent, again, go ahead and put a heart around it. And if you don't, go ahead and cross it off. And then this is going to be coochie. If you've never tried this, you need to take about a home like today. Double size of hair conditioner too. I love this. Now, as soon as you actually are done shaving, you're going to turn off the water and grab your soothing mist. So this is going to be something you are going to spray right where you just shaved. Why? You got open pores, you took a hot shower. Y'all, if your AC is pumping, you're going to open up that door. Whoo, cold breeze, what happens? Yes, yep, there was no point in shaving, me too. So I want to make sure that we actually extend your shave and it creates a protective barrier, closes the pores so the hair can't pop through right away but also it's great for my most sensitive ladies. So if you're someone who right, has a, you have skin irritations or something like that, it actually creates this barrier so that you don't get any lotions into like an open pore. It's great for a few other things too. Summertime, if you get sunburns, you're gonna wanna go ahead and use this because this is gonna have some really calming extracts in it to help soothe any redness, irritation, especially if you got those razor bumps. Great to use down there too. That's gonna be your soothing mist. Now. Does anybody have any body art? Any tattoos? Ooh, awesome. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna ask you to do. If you can go ahead and push up your sleeves, I'm gonna come around and give y'all a squirt of this right on top of your forearm. You're gonna rub forearm to forearm, leaving your hands free. All right, because we're gonna play with those later. Mm -hmm. This is our body do. Oh, thank you. I'm glad that yours is right there. You're actually Same. gonna, oh, awesome, even better. <laughs> You're gonna see what this does. It actually is going to make your tattoos look brand new. And this is a love story scent. So that gold and white bubble, I know, it almost makes it look brand new, which is great. So not, it's not just for the body art, right? But this is going to be your everyday hydrator. So we just put that mm. soothing... Mm. <laughs> this is almost in sync. It was it's super awesome. cute. <laughs> That's totally fair. So after you put on the soothing mist, you're going to spray your body dew right on top. It soaks all the way down to the lipid layer of your skin, hydrating from the inside out. If you're using a water-based lotion on a hot day, it's going to evaporate throughout the day. And then at the end of the day, you're going to go home, take your pants off, and you'll be like, 
My legs are dry. I swear, I moisturized this morning. You don't have to worry about that. This is going to be fabulous for that. If you happen to tan, whether you fake bake spray or naturally tan, it's going to help extend that tan by keeping the skin cells on the skin longer. Mark down your body dew if you enjoy that one. Most women maybe have an insecurity or two. So we want to make sure that you are leaving here with the most confidence possible. I've got two products that are going to give you some extra body confidence. So from the face, we're going to use our Firm Believer, and this is going to be our essential oil roller blend. For our body boost, this is going to be chin to toes, all right? So let's start here. It's caffeine infused. This is a firming cream that's going to lift tone, tighten the skin. So for me, what makes me feel a little insecure is actually my cellulite. I think I was born with cellulite. It doesn't discriminate on your size. So for me, I want to wear comfortable clothes. I want to be able to wear shorts in the summertime and not feel like I'm walking around like rocking my hail damage. So you're going to use this two times a day, rubbing in circular motions, and that is going to help give the skin an instant plumping. It's going to help instantly improve that texture. And with prolonged use, it's actually going to provide those really significant results. You can use this anywhere on the neck, right? If any of this jiggles in the chest area, you've got the underneath the arms, breast, booty, belly, anywhere that you want from chin to toes, two times a day, rubbing in circular motions. So that's your body boost. Go ahead and mark that one off if that one appeals to you. Now, for my ladies who are trying to look young, I have a milestone birthday this year, so I'm trying to make sure that I look as young as possible. This is gonna be your firm believer. It's gonna have frankincense, rose hip and carrot seed oils in it. Those are all known to help relax those super tight lines. So if you've got those fine lines and wrinkles, you're gonna to wanna to apply this every day in the morning and you're going to start to see those instantly just, or slowly just uh, open up and they're not as tight. So helping reduce the look of wrinkles and fine lines. The pair together, y'all, is a dynamic duo. So that's your confidence duo right here. Your firm believer and your body boost. Go ahead and mark those off. All right, ladies, so as women, we kind of experience something interesting. We typically have two body parts that rub together, cause a little chafing. Anybody experience that during the summertime? Yes. yes. All right. So we just came out pretty recently with this product, and you guys, it is going to blow your mind. It's called Chafe Escape. So for my ladies that know what chafing is, right, it's going to cause irritation. I mean, it could even get so bad. We've got those red bumps and even open sores. So let me tell you about this Chafe Escape. It's going to be an anti-friction elixir, elixir. So what this is, goes on as a lotion and dries to a powder finish. I'm going to have you guys test this out here in just a second, but I want to tell you just a smidge more about it. So what makes this a little bit different is that Chafe Escape is going to be tapioca starch based. A lot of things that people use for chafing have talcum in it. Mm -hmm. And talcum is a cancer causing agent. So this is going to be something that is great for you. Now it's a great unisex product. You as a light marine scent, so it's not going to have a noticeable scent for anyone, but it does smell pretty good. And if you have a partner in your life, right, who has testicles, they probably will enjoy this too for their chafing. Okay, this is a serious need. So take two fingers and you're going to run down the tops of my hands. You're going to quickly see which one, just the top. Oh, okay. Yep. Like this? Nope. Rub down. Rub. Wait, what do you mean? Don't yep, you're drums, like, like yes. Oh, wait, what do you mean? Can you feel the difference yeah, on which yeah. one? Isn't that it's crazy? That. Yes. So you don't have to worry about that sticking. I mean, you can play the drums on me. That's fine. Pretty easy going. So that's going to be your chafe escape. And a lot of times, going to be great for ladies who exercise too. So if you're like a biker, a runner, something like that, this is a great option to add. If you think about it. You might be like leaving that gym, maybe you're leaving work, trying to go out for a happy hour. I want to make sure that you guys smell as sexy as possible, especially if you've been sweating, you're out during the summertime. This is where our kiss is going to come in handy. This is going to be your like adult sexy body splash. Now what makes this a little bit different and what makes a lot of our products different is it has pheromones in it. So this and the body do have pheromones. What do you all know about pheromones? They attract people. Ooh. Yes. Are you feeling attracted to me? Because I have them on. <laughs> Thank you. Anything else? Well, she's right. This is your natural sex attraction. What's pretty cool is y'all are just sitting in here radiating sexy. Right? Hair flat. Yes, that is how cool this is. But my job is to amplify that sexiness and make sure that you feel this sexy all day possible. So what I'm going to ask you to do is if you have any jewelry on, you can move that out of the way, all right? And give yourself a nice little kiss of scent. This is our new Amore scent. So you're going to see that pink and um, yellow design in the bubble. 
And if you like that one, mark it off. <laughs> Don't you put it on, you're like, man, I feel so sexy. That's what happens to me. <laughs> exactly, it's so easy. This is also going to spray out cool. So if you're someone who is super hot, you're so hot, comes in flashes, great for you to have a couple bottles. I like to keep a bottle on my car door, right? You know, everybody's got that little like container on the door. Yeah, yeah just put this in that little pocket. That way, no matter where you are, where you're going, you are constantly going to smell super sexy. Let me ask you. Have you ever walked past somebody of the opposite sex or somebody of the same sex, right? You just walk past somebody and they smell so good and you're like, <laughs> you should feel a warm and tingly downstairs. <laughs> that might just happen. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, so any celebrity crushes that you can name off the top of your head? Any? I love Tom Cruise, honestly. Really? <laughs> okay, I'm not judging you for that, but that's cool. You know who I like that most people probably? Who? Yeah. Blake Griffin. Oh, really? I think yeah, Keanu yes, he's cute. Oh, yeah. Your type is interesting. <laughs> All right, no judgment, right? So, ladies, this is who I like to call Shamar Moore. So, I don't know if he tickles oh, your. Oh, yes. <laughs> he can get it too. Yeah. chocolate. Yes. So, uh, I want you to close your eyes and take a nice deep whiff and see whoever comes to mind because if you have a partner, all they gotta do is wear this and they're gonna turn into whoever that celebrity is. It's that cool, just watch out where you're feeling. <laughs> Not everybody has a six pack. So uh, this is one of our masculine scents that we actually call Titan. Comes in four different products. So you're going to have a spray, a shave, clean, also hydrate, right? I know it happens to me too. <laughs> Little leather amber bergamot, it's the <laughs> ultimate recipe for sexy here. Now what if I told you it has pheromones in it? Oh, now they're going to be extra <laughs> sexy to you. Now, I have kind of that same kind of sexiness, but for you. And it's what our, we like to call dirty French. Oh, right? Just wait till you smell this. So I would love to give you the opportunity to try this. You're welcome to try this on your wrist, and I'm going to let you spray that if you'd like. So dirty French. Okay. When I first smell this, right, this is like date night sexy. But I want to feel date night sexy every single day. I want that. I want to feel desired. And it's amazing that this fragrance can make that how I felt like you were just having a moment there where you're like, I want to feel date night sexy too. <laughs> All right. So if you would like spray this right on one of your wrists, okay, you're going to have a little bit of raspberries, wild orchid, wrapped in vanilla musk, y'all. This is Paris right at your fingertips. And I'm just saying, if you're someone who likes that designer, right, you like the little luxury, this price will blow you away because mm. it is, and you're not paying. This smells good. Oh, right? Yeah. Don't you put that on? You're like, okay, mm -hmm, I'm feeling myself tonight. It's like money. Yes. <laughs> so mark off that dirty French if you like that. We're going to move into a little foreplay. Now they got you feeling good, ready for a fun evening foreplay. This is my favorite analogy. Are you ready? Men are like microwaves, and women are like ovens. Hang on, let me break it down for you. So that microwave is ready to go with the push of a button. You just press start, <laughs> it starts cooking, all right? <laughs> Ironically, hot dogs, you can't cook them for more than 30 seconds. So, otherwise they explode. <laughs> Hashtag true story, okay? So 22 seconds in my microwave and that's it. Otherwise, they explode. Now the oven, okay? <laughs> you gotta preheat that oven. You're trying to throw a frozen pizza in a cold oven and expect magic to happen. Well, that happens in the bedroom all the time. Like, no, we're gonna preheat that baby and then she's got to cook, okay? So we're talking two things that take a little bit of time. My job today is going to make sure that we try and maybe slow down that microwave a little bit, but I'm gonna try and speed up the oven too with some of my foreplay tips, okay? Who would kill for a massage right now? Yeah, I know, thank you. Every woman's gonna be down for a massage. So we actually have these awesome gloves and they're gonna be a great unisex color and they have a great unisex fit. And they're going to not just be for massage, okay? They're going to be for a few other things. I'm going to come around and give y'all a little hand massage here in just a second. But let's talk about how important massage actually is. Have you ever been in the bedroom? Fun things are supposed to be happening. And you are doing the grocery list on the ceiling. Where you're like, did I flip over the laundry? Did I feed the dog tonight? <laughs> right? I've been there. Women, we carry so many hats. It's so important for us to take off those hats so we can actually enjoy the bedroom experience. So we're gonna start with a massage. 
right? If I can actually have the top of your right hand, I'm gonna use my dual-sided gloves here. They're called In Good Hands, what a fun name. And uh, they have what I like to call the big ball side and the scratching side. You're gonna get to feel both because there's different textures for different uh, types of stimulation here. Um, I'm gonna actually get the top, thank you dear. So we are going to use this as a little sensual massage. You've got lavender and chamomile th aromatherapy massage lotion. Relaxation, okay, super important for women. Now, uh, we're also going to use these as your loofah in the shower. Mm. You are supposed to change your loofah every 30 days. Mm. Who's late? Yep. Yep, okay. <laughs> so what's crazy is that that is actually gonna harbor a ton of bacteria. Mm. And what we wanna make sure is that you have an option. You don't need to replace as often because the silicone is a non-porous surface. It's also going to give you a spa-like feeling every time you take a shower. Smell that, you guys. Yeah. You can also slide a little bullet in the bottom, all right? And that is a great way to introduce a bedroom accessory out of sight, out of mind. They're gonna enjoy that vibration and the relaxation of the massage that when that thing comes out, they're gonna be like, just gonna travel further south. Mm -hmm. Now lastly, your gloves are also going to be fabulous for your firming cream, right? I talked about how that firming cream is gonna be great for your cellulite. It's gonna help break up the fat deposits and help the skin renew faster. So use your In Good Hands on with your body boost as well. Guys, 80% of massages lead to something more. But I don't want you to fall asleep snoring every night, okay? Yeah. That's that 20%, okay? So I gotta actually wake you back up and get you ready and in the mood. Another essential oil blend that I have for you, it's gonna be called your Rise and Grind. This is something great to put on, especially when you're tired and at night, you're like, ugh, like, I'm too tired to play tonight. Hello, put this on ahead of time, put this on midday, two, three o'clock is when <laughs> I start hitting my wall and I'm like, okay. So I'm actually gonna pass this around. It's great if you're feeling a little sleepy right now. You've got a little citrus and peppermint blend, okay? Great to put on your wrist, neck, you can also put it on your temple. Peppermint is also known to be great for migraines and headaches. So if you're someone who deals with those on a daily basis or just once in a while, great to use too. Does that not almost feel like invigorated? I'm like, oh, just energizes and wakes up the senses. So I feel like I am now ready to go. You're no longer like, it's time for beauty rest. It's time to play. So to heighten everything that you're feeling in the bedroom, you're gonna use O. But O is also a great unisex product. So not just for you, you can also use this on a partner. It's going to be a cream-based um, product. I'll take that, thank you dear. That is going to tingle. So it's got what we call our triplex tingle. It's a proprietary blend. And it is going to help heighten any sort of touch, rub, vibration that you're feeling. It has a fun little flavor too. So we have vanilla frosting or strawberry kiwi. You can put this on the clitoris. You can also put this on the head, on the underside of the shaft, on along that main vein, and also on the testicles. Please ask before you just like rub it all over them, okay? And they'll be like, surprise, and they're all tingling downstairs, okay? So good unisex enhancement cream. Now it's time for my number one selling liquid item. This is what we call our enhancement gel, okay? Do a little anatomy with me. Make a V. Turn it upside down, stick your thumb through. All right, this is going to be your outer labia and then underneath the clitoral hood is the clitoris right there. Play with that, feels so good, all right? But here's the thing, what you see on, the, does it feel good right now? Yeah. I know. Uh, so what you see on the outside is actually just gonna be a very small portion of the clitoris. It extends about four to five inches inside and kind of sits like a wishbone and straddles the vaginal entrance, which is crazy. That's why the first one to two inches feels so good. And then they try and dig back to China and you're like, no, 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 go back, okay? So one pump in this airtight canister, meaning you're gonna get every single drop out of it great for your money's worth, okay? One pump on your index finger, put it directly on top of the clitoris. In about 30 seconds, it's gonna be a little party in your pants, you're like, hello down there. <laughs> and then in about two minutes at this point, right, you're really starting to get turned on, you're gonna start feeling yourself up. <laughs> Dang, that feels really good. And then about two more minutes later, you're gonna start pacing, because at this point, like, you cannot <laughs> sit still, okay? <laughs> what is crazy is you're gonna start scanning the room. Nobody's home, so you're gonna start scanning. What am I gonna land on, okay? Well, I don't know. There's an awkward little vase over there that looks kind of fun. But, doorknob, it's always the appropriate height. Lube will do wonders, right? Just bend over, back it up. 
you're just gonna hope somebody's trying to break in that day, right? <laughs> trying to get on the doorknob. So be careful. Next time you look at a doorknob, you are going to see. Nope. Come over to my house. Be careful. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so that's gonna be your enhancement gel. This is strictly for the clitoris and just for you. So really going to heighten everything that you're feeling. You guys, I see a ceiling fan like this and I see an orgasm. That is how cool this is, okay? It's air activated, so you can blow, and it's going to intensify. Now, I know you guys are smart, so tell me, how often do you use a lubricant? How often should you use a lubricant? Probably like every time, because like the friction is like not awesome. You're, you're right, it is not awesome. <laughs> Any other guesses? As often as you wish. Oh, uh, sure. Yep, absolutely. Yes, tickets, tickets. I know, right, all the tickets. <laughs> so this is kind of a trick question, but you should use a lubricant every single day. Oh. Just like you moisturize your face, right, condition your hair when you're gonna wash your hair, and moisturize your skin. This is your most sensitive tissue, and we wanna make sure that it just gets properly hydrated. So we're actually gonna play with our Euphoria water-based lubricant. This is one of our many lubricants, okay, and this particular one is FDA cleared. We pay millions of dollars to make sure that we are giving you the best of the best products. Now, what you typically find at your sex shops and supermarkets is not always regulated by the FDA. That can be very scary as far as not knowing if what you're putting inside your body is safe or not. We're actually gonna try this out. You guys ready? Yeah. So, we're gonna do one pump on your index finger. So, take your left index finger, flip it under. Okay, I'm gonna give you a little pump here. And I actually want you to rub with your thumb. To me, it almost feels like flutter base and silicone had a baby because it's like a little extra slippery to me. Mm -hmm. So it does feel good. Yep, you can smell it. There's no, no scent to it, which is very cool. This one doesn't have any flavor, so it's great for my most sensitive lady. So how do we use this? This is why you got napkins today. So wipe it off whenever you're done playing. You're doing the, the tacky test. Is that what you were doing, right? You got to make sure that it doesn't turn sticky over a minute. Yes, you're right. You're gonna have to do one pump on your index finger, put it up inside the vaginal canal, just like you would insert a tampon. Now, unless work turns you on, you're not gonna be walking around like dripping wet, okay? My work turns me on, so watch out. No, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> what's really cool is it has a rewetting property about it, where maybe work was stressful, you wanna come home, have a little stress relief, a little solo session, perfect. Maybe you're on a date, first date, Tinder date, I don't care what you're doing. Mm -hmm. If you're going out drinking, that's always a fun one because alcohol dehydrates the body. You're not gonna come home at 2 a.m. from the bars being like, grab the lubricant. Y'all, you're gonna go like straight to the deed because you've been feeling it all night. <laughs> Other things that might uh, dry out the body are stress, work. I know y'all said you didn't have children, but let me just tell you, children are stress, okay? Um, your medications, allergy, allergy medications, different birth controls, heart and thyroid medications. This is a side effect of many things, and it's not saying that there's a problem, Lubricant is something that you need every single day. So, you ready to see the magic happen? Okay, lick that finger and rub it back together. And you are going to start to feel it come back. It gets nice and slippery, oh. right? <laughs> so, maybe you're having somebody come over tonight. <laughs> they can go downstairs, have a little snack. <laughs> they're like, dang girl, you're wet. <laughs> High five, right? They finally think they're doing a good job for once and you're like, you got it. So that's gonna be your everyday lubricant. Now, there's going to be another option too, Pure Pleasure. This is our silicone-based lubricant. Great for your water play, great for any anal play, but also fabulous for my ladies who maybe you're chronically dry due to something like a hysterectomy, um, going through a different phase of life. So Pure Pleasure is another option for you. It's time for a little role playing. Who likes to role play? Don't answer that question. We're gonna role play today. <laughs> so, Ms. Keisha, tell me, would you like to be Romeo or Juliet? Juliet. <laughs> oh, all right. So that means you, Creamy Kristen, you are going to be Romeo. <laughs> you are going to be Juliet, and this is your Romeo. Oh, okay. All right, so I need the love story of Romeo and Juliet in like two sentences. What happens? Real short. They fall in love and they die. They're dead. Bummer. All right, so we are actually going to recreate their love story because we don't want them to die virgins, okay? They're going to go out with a bang. Literally, <laughs> all right. So, um, Juliet, nice tight fist, okay? 12 year old virgins, tight. Now, Romeo's, <laughs> left middle finger, 
why the middle? It's the longest. You're welcome. All right, now I want you to see if you can get in on her nice tight fist. No digging with nails. Oh, you're giving her the back door. That's cute. Yeah. No, no, no. Good job, girls. So, ooh, there we are. That doesn't count, right? We don't tell anybody. Now, Romeos, let me see your left middle finger, flip it under, and I'm going to give you a little dose of lubricant. Time out. I just gave you a penis. Now I'm giving you lube, and you're like really excited, ready to put it in. You see what happens to them? That's what happens. Don't do anything. I just gave you a penis. That's nice. Oprah, you get a penis. You get a penis. Yes. Now, do me a favor. Flip them over. They pass what I like to call my Dairy Queen test. There's nothing worse than having lubricant all the way down your butt crack, and it's like in your hair. Right. You're like, how, how did that happen? R yes. So, not going anywhere. Okay. Juliet's, nice tight fish. Y'all are so virgins, right, for some, didn't count. So, we talked about foreplay. You gotta rub on her. Give her a nice little massage. <laughs> <laughs> all right, there's never that much foreplay. Go ahead and try and put it in now. Stay tight, ladies. See if they can get in now with Lucy. Oh, <laughs> you were sticking around in there. I like it. Now, before you actually um, rub this completely, um, you can have a little taste. This is going to be birthday cake. It's actually my birthday month, so you can have your cake and eat it too. Oh, Woo! I Thank have a milestone you. as well, so, you know. Yay! Oh, my gosh. We are twins. So that's going to be called your whipped lubricant, okay? Great for all your male sleeves and C-rings and obviously your oral favors. All right, that was so much fun, wasn't it? It really was. Okay, so you know what, Keisha, I have a question for you. Why did you want to have a girls' night tonight? I really just wanted to share the wealth with my friends oh. and, you know, teach them a little something and make their home lives a little more exciting. Yes. Did you have fun at the last party you went to? I had an amazing time. Yes. So much fun. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so you nailed the three reasons pretty much why ladies are going to have their own girls nights. Number one, they're fun. You had a great time. Number two, you wanted to share that with your friends. Mm -hmm. Number three, you get hooked up for having your friends over tonight. So number one is fun. Number two is friends. Number three is free, free stuff. My hostesses don't pay full price for anything. So I have a very generous gift for you today. You're also going to get a shopping spree and I might have a little extra discount for you too. But I'm going to give y'all the same opportunity that she had. So these are going to be uh, bonuses. They range from $100 to $400. And the game is going to go party or pass. So you can see each of those has a little scratch off. I'm going to ask you if you want to have your own girl's night. Do you want to party or pass? Pass if you're not interested, no big deal. If you're like, you know what? I want free stuff. This is fun. I want to share the wealth with my friends. Go ahead and say party and I want you to scratch this off. All right? So game goes party or pass. When we have three ladies who want to have their own girl's nights, when they hold their parties on their original party dates, you're gonna get an extra hundred dollars to spend, all right? So, party or pass? Um, I'll party. Perfect. <laughs> <Take> one. <laughs> right, scratch that off. Party or pass? I'll pass. Yep, totally I just fine. I feel like I'm really busy. Yeah, I understand. No big deal. Party or pass? Uh, I'll party. Ooh, fun. <laughs> oh, you like that one? All right, scratch them off. Let's see what you got. We all wanna know. These are gonna be big bonuses. Oh, what you got? What you got? What you got? Oh. Oh, I think I got two hundred dollars. Oh, heck yeah, two hundred. <laughs> oh, so did I. Oh, did oh twins! Yeah. Fantastic. You guys, hang on to those. So you're actually going to get an extra two hundred dollars added to your total party sales. Take ten percent of that, and that's going to be an extra shopping spree for you. So twenty dollars each you get, and you already are getting sales as soon as I walk up to your party. Sound good? Yes. All right. Who's ready for toys? Me, right? Yes. I know that's why y'all are here. Well, let's introduce toys in an interesting way. So, like, why would you want a bedroom toy? Well, I kind of think of your sex lives like vanilla ice cream, right? You can have vanilla ice cream, and that's cool. But it might be nice to add some sprinkles someday, whipped cream, a little cherry. Put some nuts on that bad boy, all right? So things are going to get really interesting. So it doesn't have to be something you use every time, but it's a great way to have some options and some variety in the bedroom. I want you to pick at least three that you want to take home because many women are going to take home three tonight, all right? There's four, I should say, there's six different types of orgasms that we are going to talk about. Can you guess them? You're going to get tickets for any guesses. Can you name all six? 
Vaginal. Vaginal, yes. So these are at different avenues to orgasm. Vaginal. Mental? Mental. That would be really impressive. Okay. <laughs> um, yes, girl. G-spot. Oh, you guys are so smart. Okay, so we've got vaginal, clitoral, G-spot. Yep, so that's clitoral. Anal. Oh, okay. Anal, yes. Can you say oral? Oral. What do you mean by that? Like, you could have an orgasm while giving someone oral? You could, yep. There's lots of different avenues. So we're going to talk about um, nipple stimulation. Oh, yeah. Clitoral stimulation, vaginal stimulation, G-spot, anal, and blended. Blended is going to be multiple forms of those, okay? Because we know most women need multiple forms of stimulation. Now, before we jump right into the toys, we've got to make sure that you take care of them properly. Your toys are an investment of your body, so you're actually going to want to clean them and store them properly. Our Come Clean is going to be our antibacterial, antifungal, pH balanced toy cleaner. What's going to make this different is that I'm not saying that your hand soap and dish soap isn't going to clean your toys, but if you've ever done the dishes, your hands are typically pretty dry when you're done. So you want to make sure that you're using something that's safe enough for the materials that we use because our silicone is so soft and so sensitive that we don't want it to dry out and crack and harbor any bacteria. Okay, so you're gonna actually spray it down, let it sit for 30 seconds, wash it off with warm water. Give it a nice big shake. And then I want you to drop it right in your toy tote. Aren't they pretty? They're also discreet. So one toy per tote. Very important that you know this. So for however many toys you have at home, however many you're taking home today, you need to take home a toy tote for each one. Why? Well, sometimes toys can melt together and then you got one giant unitoto and you don't have that many holes. So it doesn't work anymore. <laughs> <laughs> the inside of this is also going to have BioShield 75. That is going to be protect them from getting any sort of, uh, it's moisture wicking, so not going to let it grow any mold or anything while it's in there. Also great to have that antibacterial, antibac uh, antifungal properties too. So going to keep them safe in between uses. We're going to start off with the opening act. Now here's how this works. On your papers, I'm gonna have you guys write a scale of one to 10 just off of initial appeal. And when we run through all of them, we're gonna go back and have a little toy parade. It's just as fun as it sounds, I promise. You're gonna to get to play with all of them at the end. Opening act is first, and this is gonna be one of the most versatile toys. It's great for my veterans. So if you're like, girl, I have like a whole drawer full at home, awesome. If this one's not in there, you need to actually take it home. All right, don't worry, I can't get this out of the box. There we go. If you are someone who's like, I'm a little nervous about this part of the party, I'm not sure that that's my thing, I don't know if I like need that, this is a good one to introduce too. It can be a great full back and body massager. The vibrations on this are very fun, but it doesn't hopefully look intimidating to a partner because for the most part, you're just gonna use this externally. So you could actually get right up and down the shoulders and back, okay, it just becomes a body massager. Great to use on the nipples. It actually has a flexible head, so it's gonna be great for a few different other positions. But again, you can use that directly on top of the clitoris, even massaging the entire vulva area. Now, you don't have to answer this out loud, but have you ever suffocated during doggy style? Okay, well, I have. And so, right, you've been like face first in the pillow, you got your hair in your face, you're like <laughs> trying not to die. Why? Because you're not propped up properly, right? You're too busy trying to make it feel better. So this is going to be a great way for you to not suffocate. You're going to hand this to them, put it exactly where you want it on the clitoris, and you cannot prop yourself up properly. Just watch out, okay, because you don't want a concussion into the headboard. That's another thing that I can't help with. But <laughs> 30 function with this. 30. Just wait till y'all feel this. Take the 30-day challenge of like 30-day squats. How fun does that feel? Right? Woohoo! No, take after three days. Y'all, your 30-day challenge of your mental clarity by day three is going to be awesome. So scale one to 10, mark down. What do you think about the opening act? Now, everything I show you is going to be USB rechargeable. They plug in just like your cell phones. They're also uh, water submersible for up to three feet for 30 minutes. Fabulous. So you can take these in the shower, hot tub, neighbor's pool, whatever you're doing, all right? <laughs> going to be a fun one, too. The only person who gets to play ahead of time is my hostess. So you ready for this? I'm ready. All right. That is for you. All right, turn that bad boy on. What happens? Nothing? Are you sure? Keep playing. Keep trying. Did you break my toy? 
No, you have the remote. Oh, yeah. Isn't that fun? All right. So what you're looking at here is what we call our box. Play with me, girl. Turn me out. Yes. Oh, look at the variety. This is it's fun being in control, isn't it? All right. So your box office is going to be remote control panties. How cool is this? They made this perfect. So this is actually going to sit right on top of your panties and you've got magnetic wings so it locks in place. Okay? Go put on your date night panties, like the granny panties, those are fine. Not your regular ones, but your cute ones, okay? And this will fit perfectly right up inside. Now it's going to be very quiet once it's up against the body and you guys, you don't even need a partner to play with you. If you're sexy and single, put these babies on, pass that around the bar, it's gonna be the best night of your life, okay? <laughs> But if you're someone like me, we go on date nights and, well, I feel like date nights always end up back at like Walmart or Home Depot or something. Does that ever happen to you where you're like, oh, let's go out and do something fun? And you're like, okay, well, since we're out, you might as well do something productive. Right. All right. Evil. Yes. <laughs> How fun. Woo! Friday night. Okay. So here's what you're actually going to do. You're going to leave your cell phone in the car. And when you pull up in the parking lot, you're going to hand them that little guy and you're saying, you know what, I have to go to the bathroom. Will you just meet me inside in like five minutes or so? Right? And they're going to be like, sure, how am I going to find you if you're leaving your cell phone with me? Well, we're going to play a little game of Marco Polo. So, this has a 32 foot range. Get ready. Because you don't need to be, even need to be yelling Marco Polo, okay? They're going to walk in and be like, how am I supposed to find her? <laughs> you guys. Once they get within range, you're in like the pancake aisle and you're like, hold on the shelf, screaming, Aunt Jemima! They're gonna know exactly <laughs> where you're at. All right, so very fun to turn date night into something a little different. Mm -hmm. I will take that back, thank you. Now, if you're also one of my ladies who um, has never orgasm doing dishes, <laughs> well, here you go, super easy. You don't even need to hold on, you can multitask. Very easy, right? Who doesn't want to orgasm while you're like doing all the folding laundry, all that stuff. Now. I love this one. It's so pretty. Can we just admire this? Be like, oh. <laughs> this is going to be our V39. It's part of our Euphoria collection. This is the best of the best that we have to offer. So you've got premium silicone. You're also going to have 18 karat rose gold. I mean, it's just beautiful. But it actually has a really interesting feature about it, too. It has a heating element that we call Kaleo. It heats up to 104 degrees. So why do you actually need heat to begin with? Because I was like, wait a minute. What do I, what? Heat? What do you mean? Well, a lot of women actually have scar tissue up inside the vaginal area. Whether that be from lack of lubrication, you've had childbirth, medical procedures, anything like that. And when you have all that scar tissue, it's very hard to orgasm without that loosening up, okay? So we're gonna help do that with the added heating element in the backside. This is one of our most multi-purpose toys that we have. So let me show you how the V39 is going to satisfy like all your needs in one. It has a very direct point. So it can be great for tracing the nipples, okay? Fun stimulation there. You can use that again for that direct clitoral stimulation. This one has 12 functions. You can also set this right on top of the pubic bone. And this is gonna hit the entire vulva area. Fun fact, when you actually look down, what you see is the vulva. The vaginal area is inside, you can't see that. You can just see the vaginal entrance. So make sure that when you're um, talking about that, right, that is the vulva area. You can insert this for the first one to two inches. Remember how we said that's the part that feels so good, right? Because that's actually where your clitoris straddles. Or you can slide it in fuller and hit that G-spot area. So it's great for nipples, clitoris, vaginal and G-spot orgasms, plus that heating element. You just wait, mark that down, scale one to 10. What do you think about the V39? Let's move these out of the way. Oh guys, what's in this box is super fun. It's not like anything you've seen so far. It's very fun and creative. So if you're someone who's ready to take your bedroom to the next level, whether that be by yourself or with a partner, Twilight Mood is going to make this happen. So when you look at it, you're like, Okay, that's the super special thing. It is, because it's flexible. And it's going to hold its shape. So it actually gives you a ton of variety as far as your options for stimulation. This is going to, guys, look, it even has a tongue at the top here. So if you like the nickel, nipples flicked, licked, something fun like that, this is gonna do that for you, right? You can use this if you need an extension downstairs. This is going to help you and gives you several inches to reach a clitoris. Fabulous. 
You can also insert this and it now becomes your G-spot stimulator. Are you ready for this? We're gonna turn it into a dual action all the way. Either way, you can actually slide this in this way or the opposite way. And now you have internal vaginal stimulation, first one to two inches, and you're getting that clitoris lick just like everybody does, okay? <laughs> now, we said lube can do wonders. You're gonna use your water-based lubricant and you can actually welcome somebody into the bedroom with you. This is thin enough where you can slide, they can slide right underneath, and now they are getting that stimulation up and down the shaft. You are getting that internal fuller feeling and you are getting that clitoral stimulation too. This one can also help fulfill their number one fantasy of a threesome. Most women are not super excited to welcome somebody else into the bedroom. So this allows for vaginal stimulation, clitoral stimulation, and then also they can enjoy some anal play with you, right? So they can penetrate into the anus and now you've got, right? All three for them, satisfying their wildest fantasies. Go ahead and mark down Twilight Mood. What are your initial thoughts? Next is something you haven't seen before. When I first saw this one, you guys, I think it's my job to show you really the best of the best. When you look at some of the bedroom options that are available, you're not finding this. So this is called your behind the scenes. It is going to be a flexible for you. It also has a massaging ball. So you could use this as a handle and be great for the clitoral stimulation. But guess what? We're actually gonna slide it inside and it can become a G-spot stimulator. If I ask you where's your clitoris, right? Typically you know where that's at. But if I ask you where's your G-spot, you're like, I don't know, somewhere up inside there. Okay, and if you're relying on something straight, it's not gonna typically be stimulated. So it's somewhere between one and a half to about three inches up inside the vaginal canal. We used to say take two fingers and do the come hither motion. But you'd be here for like three freaking years and have carpal tunnel by the time you <laughs> orgasmed, okay? G-spot's really sensitive. So this one actually does it for you, which is amazing. So 10 different vibration options and then three fast to fastest as far as this rotating ball. Are you ready for this? Look at that. That is amazing. Yeah. That is this motion, y'all. You don't even have to do anything, but hold it still. Put a partner in charge of this. They are going to love to see your reaction because a G-spot orgasm is totally different than a clitoral orgasm, all right? Now, what's even better is this one, it makes a great first anal toy. As far as anal penetration goes and anal stimulation to begin with, once a product crosses the front and goes to the back side of the body, it no longer is a front toy or front body toy, all right? So you could use this to actually just stimulate the back door. You don't have to have that entrance. There's tons of nerve endings on the outside, but this is a great one to use that pure pleasure with, and you can enjoy some anal stimulation. Also great for prostate massaging too. Each partner needs their own toy, so you do not cross and share toys together, okay? So each partner gets their own behind the scenes. Mark down, scale one to 10. What do you think about that bad boy? Can I, anybody put in 100? Because your girl is. Let's talk about those blended orgasms. So we said you need multiple points of, of stimulation typically. And that's gonna be where your main attraction comes in. We wanted to know what do women need. You are not a one size fits all. So this gives you the option to have a really customizable experience. It's gonna have a flexible internal piece. So it conforms to your body shape and tilt and curve and all of those things. Plus it has a flexible clitoral stimulator. You guys, I'm just saying, if the tongue at home doesn't do this, <laughs> you need to go home with this, okay? I wouldn't be in business if they did. So I know nobody's tongue's gonna move that fast, which is great. That's speed two out of 10. So you have 10 fast to fastest options and independently controlled motors. So inside and outside really get that customized stimulation. Now its shape is pretty unique, because I was like, wait a minute, larger ball into a smaller area. Well, as this comes in, it's actually going to start anchoring behind the pubic bone, and that's where your G-spot stimulation comes from. But its shape is unique because your vaginal walls actually want to clamp down on something smaller, when we're talking Kegels, right? So that's your pelvic floor strength. Does everyone know what Kegels are? Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. so. Think about it, if your muscles are clamping down on something large, it's kind of like doing a bicep curl, but only just doing this part. How big are your biceps gonna get? Your body wants to do the full muscle contraction, maximizing that pelvic floor, making sure that it's super strong, and also 
the stronger they are, the stronger your orgasms are. This is incredibly important. So not only is this gonna be great for your sexual purposes, but great for your vaginal health too. Go ahead and mark down, what do you think about that main attraction? Scale of one to 10, how cool is this one? You guys, I have knocked over everything up here today, I swear. Time to talk about anal play. Who's excited? Well, y'all said you love anal, so I know you're excited. <laughs> As far as anal play goes, there's a right and a wrong way to do that. Most people have either themselves or a friend who has experienced this. Maybe you're like, oh, liquid courage. Drink too much one night, you're like, okay, let's go try anal play. And well, you wake up the next morning, and you're like, nope, never doing that again, that hurts. Okay, I don't want you to have that experience because when it's done right, it can actually be done wonderfully, okay? so. Relaxation, lubrication, communication are the keys to anal play. Relax. That does not mean go down two bottles of wine. That means get a massage, right? I showed you some fabulous massage items. Get a massage first, relax. Maybe one glass of wine if you have to, but that's it. Booty Ease is a great product to put on ahead of time. It's gonna soak in and absorb and just is a comfort gel, all right? Then you're gonna use your pure pleasure. It's imperative that you use that frictionless, silicone-based lubricant, allowing for frictionless entry and exit. Now, communication is key. One inch per minute. Write that down, one inch per minute. I actually suggest for a woman to be on top, especially for the first few times, because I want you to really make sure that you are going as comfortably as you need to. They typically learn about anal play from some videos that they've seen on right, the internet. Well, that's not reality, okay? So we're gonna make sure it's done right. When your options are zero to penis, okay, this is a great <laughs> anal trainer, right? So let me introduce you to Midnight Desire. These are going to be vibrating anal beads that actually have that same kind of flexible um, inside as your twilight mood. So they're very adjustable. But I like the spacing of the beads so it gives your body time to adjust. So again, relax, use that proper loop, and then I want you to be in control so that if you are in any sort of discomfort, you need to tell your partner, right? Slow down, allow your body time to adjust. But what we know to be true is that anal play happens to be just about the best way for you and your partner to experience orgasms. So, if you have not tried an anal orgasm, you are missing out. Again, this one is gonna be another one to help fulfill their number one fantasy of that threesome, okay? So they can actually have vaginal penetration, then you've got some anal stimulation going on at the same time. That is a very uh, thin kind of wall in between vaginal and anal canals that it's actually going to be pressured. They're gonna cross feel that vibration. Wonderful, 10 different functions with this one. So this is gonna be your midnight desire. Scale of one to 10, mark that one down. I showed you how that flexible one was going to be a great couples toy. Well, this is another more traditional couples option called double feature. So with double feature, you've got two rings, okay? Inner ring goes around the shaft, second ring is optional to go around the testicles. If you're like, you know what girl, that looks kind of small. Well, guess what, I promise it stretches. But if you're like, no, it's still not going to fit in there, guess what, send me a text message, I'd love to see it. Just kidding, don't do that. <laughs> So you are going to use your Romeo and Juliet lubricant, okay? That was funny, wasn't it? <laughs> and that is going to be an emollient-based oh, lubricant, right? Shoot. Nice, thick and creamy. You guys already experienced that. It's actually going to help slide this all the way down so it doesn't pinch and pull skin and hair, okay? What's really nice is you can actually just slip this one up if you want to get it out of the way, and you can use the secondary ring. Why would they want testicle constriction? Now, and I mean that in a nice way because we're not, we're not making them go crazy, but this is actually gonna provide prostate stimulation externally. So there's a societal stigma that anal entrance determines your sexuality. When in reality, your pleasure spot as a male is really inside of you, okay? So this is going to allow them to help experience that and helps reduce the risk of cancer with prostate stimulation regularly. So no, this is good for their health. You just tell them that, okay? Your three lines here are going to be your clitoral stimulation. But what's even better is, like I said, my job is gonna be to slow down that microwave a little bit. A little constriction is gonna help keep the blood flow into the tip of the penis so that the penis stays erect longer, right? Not lengthwise, time-wise, okay? <laughs> so great also is your own personal clitoral vibrator. Put this right on your fingers and you can use this directly on top of the clitoris. You can also 
right, if you've ever hummed during oral favors, you don't have to worry about humming anymore. Put this on the outside of your cheek, and it is now going to hum, going to help them finish faster. No more lock jaw. You will love that way easier. So mark down one to ten. What do you think of that double feature? Is anybody at ten yet? Anybody want to have an orgasm yet? <laughs> ten, like love. Yes. Yes. You gotta say it, girl. Right now, that's a little creepy. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. I want to have an orgasm tonight. Oh, I'm having one tonight. Woo! <laughs> so funny. All right, so. <laughs> Creamy Kristen, was that you too? Are you in on the orgasm tonight? Go ahead and hang on to that. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm pretty close. You're at nine? You're at nine. All right, so we'll get you to, we'll get you to ten, I think. All right. I need two more volunteers from you. You, I can be you and a friend, or it can be two of friends of your choice. Let's do uh, Creamy Kristen <laughs> and Bang Me Brianna. All right, ladies, put your stuff down. Come on up. So, who would you like to be Romeo and Juliet? Um, she was Romeo last night, so let's make her Juliet. Okay, great. Come on up. So you're gonna be Romeo. Okay. All right, that's yours. All right, come on up here, Creamy Kristen. <laughs> That's all right. Okay, so let's, you are actually going to help us demonstrate our male sleeve. So you've got Romeo over there, and you're going to actually loop her up, all right? So you need to use Romeo and Juliet lubricant that we call whipped. Yep, go ahead, just put it right on there. Yep. You didn't know what you guys were in for today. <laughs> Rub it in. It doesn't just sit there. It'd be nice if they did it themselves, but typically not the case. Good job. I know. Your hands are going to be looby. It's going to be totally fine. Remember, it tastes good, so you can lick it off later. So here's what I want you to do. You don't need to stretch this, stretch this out. It actually will just slide right on top. All you need to do is hold your penis still. All right? It'll come out the other end. I promise. Okay. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. There we go. <laughs> okay. Well, it doesn't just sit there. So show us how this is done. I know you can do it. Yeah, there you go. So this is going to be good for your <laughs> manual favors. <laughs> oh, boy. you guys are way too much fun with that. All right, give them a round of applause. I'll take that back over. Great job, ladies. You were fabulous. You can wipe that off or rub it off. So let me introduce you to Hey Mr. DJ. Right, this is going to be our suction cup dildo. So in case you want something that does not vibrate, it's pretty lifelike, this is a great option for you. Now hand jive, you absolutely have to have the whipped lubricant with that. This is going to be thick enough so that they don't feel fingers and thumbs. All right, they do get tired of that sensation. What's also awesome is it's reversible. How it is like right now, it's going to have a horizontal striping on the inside. And that is going to kind of feel like vaginal play. So it actually uh, sucks and swallows for you too. So it's even better, right? Hold the bottom, pull up across the top, pinch and pull. And it actually is going to oh, suck wow. for you. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Y'all are going to take this one. Guess what? Right? As long as you pinch, it'll swallow for you too. And it cleans itself up. You're just going to hand this to them, hand them a bottle of toy cleaner and be like, well, you made that mess, you clean it up. Wow. <laughs> made your job way easy. Flip it inside out, the diamond texture on the inside is going to be nice and tight, kind of like anal play. So you don't even have to put out there if you don't want to. So how do we get this thing on? Because that's always kind of interesting, because some people look at that and be like, uh, I don't know, right? You weren't sure it was going to fit. Like, it fits. <laughs> You're going to tell them to lay down in bed, okay? Grab your little sexy piece of lingerie, you know, walk in with that bag, and they're going to be like, what's in the bag? Lay down and I'll show you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so at the bottom of the bed, you're going to put your hand jive, your cell phone, and your whipped, your Romeo and Juliet lubricant. You're going to straddle them and say, it's going to be the best thing you've ever felt. Nice wink. All right, <laughs> throw, the cup, or throw the covers up and over your back. <laughs> Watch out, it's waiting for you. Grab that lubricant, lube up the penis, do a little tongue around the top. You're going to pop this baby on and what? If you can bob your head, you can do it too. Make some <laughs> weird sounds. Yeah, it does it all. What's your cell phone for, right? Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat. Don't snap this, That's all right? <laughs> you oh got like gosh. 30 seconds to catch up on your day on social media. Oh. So that is going to be your hand dive and your Hey Mr. DJ. Ladies, we are going to start the toy parade. Are you ready? Yeah. 
So I am going to start back at the top at opening act. All right. I want you to adjust your ratings as you fall in love with them. If you're like, nah, maybe not this time. All right. And I want you to try them on your nose. Your nose is made of similar tissue as the clitoris. So I know if you happen to want to sneeze, and we like to call those sneeze gasms, that toy picked you. 30 functions. So take your time with this. You push the bottom button underneath the purple light. Oh my goodness. Right? <laughs> Make you want to see. <laughs> yeah, that we hurt that one. You need to take that one home. <laughs> All right, so box office. This is going to be the remote controlled one. You actually, I want you to hang on to the remote control because you are going to be in charge of everyone's pleasure. Okay. Okay. Got it. So you can actually feel what I was feeling on being on the receiving end of that. Oh my goodness. Okay. No. You need to take oh, yeah. that one home. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, dear. All right, so your V39 is coming around next. Oh, this is God. your heated one. So you're going to feel that heating element on the back side here. Again, 12 functions. You can use the up and down arrows to experience all of those. <laughs> oh my God. I seriously love that thing. I feel like you just need to take it home tonight so you can play oh, tonight. <laughs> I know, me too. All right, dear, I will take that and trade you. This is your flexible one. Start wearing underwear. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the warning. So glad we did lingerie over the clothes. All right. Yeah, your flexible one. Isn't that one fun? This one actually is going to have two different buttons. Your zigzag is going to be your vibration, and then your kind of bullseye is going to be the speed of the rotating ball. Remember, this one is going to be good for G-spots and anal stimulation. So I'll just turn both on there for Oh, it's so hot. Is it? Isn't that yeah, nice and warm? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Nobody wants it, like, cold. Uh, right? How <laughs> awkward is Yes. When I think of something cold, right, I'm like, oh, mm -mm. Gynecologist, what do you think of like the whoo? That's oh, cold. It's so hot. The light. Yeah, you know the light that they shine. <laughs> I do know the light. <laughs> All right, main attraction is next. So this is going to have left is going to be external, right is going to be internal. Play with both, and you can really find that customized fit for you. <laughs> that was a fun face. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, girl, you got that one up to 10? Almost. Yeah. Almost there. <laughs> That's like your 30 second finish right there. Speeding up that oven. All right, next one coming around is going to be your anal toy one. Again, this one is going to be flexible for you, and there's got a single button on the bottom there for you to check out all of those 10 functions. Hi, yes. <laughs> Yeah, make like sure you mark that one down. <laughs> What'd you say? I feel like we're officially Wait. best friends. Oh, we are. <laughs> yep. We already crossed that line. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. Right. Ah! <laughs> yes, the range of that is yeah. amazing. Now, double features next, and that's going to be your C-ring, all right? Oh. So that's going to be a great little couple. So <laughs> Kayla's like, all right, new best friend. Right. I'll take that one home tonight. <laughs> What scented candle do I love? Oh, now it, oh, it it's really changed. Yeah. Ah, it's so fine. That's crazy. Okay. Can I turn this Okay. Oh my god. You good, Kristen? Yeah. Okay. I'm <laughs> so fun. That's crazy. Um, crazy oh yeah, fast. Yep. Well, I yeah, I, I mean, I don't think you want the demo <laughs> one, but don't worry, I've got one for you to take home tonight. Does it have All right, ladies, as you are wrapping up those, make sure you adjust your numbers. And then I want you to check out, scan over that wish list, see if anything that you had marked off had an asterisk next to it. Because that's going to lead us into the next part. I want you to actually go ahead, flip over your wish list, and on the back side, you are going to see our smart party packages. Thank you, dear. So on the back, flip those over, and you're going to see the smart packages 
those are going to be our new consultant starter kits. Now, anything that I put an asterisk next to are actually included in some of those packages. You guys have gotten to see the whole show and how easy it is to just share some amazing products with your friends. So we're gonna do a little game so that I can um, answer some of these questions. But first, I wanna walk through the packages with you. That $9.99, that's gonna be what we call your deluxe kit. That's the most popular starter kit, and that's what I started with. What is going to make this one super special, it has six premium toys, has 12 liquid items, and on top of that, you're going to have 40% commission with this. Now, take anything that you liked on the front side and take 40% off because you have a 40% personal discount with this one too. Go ahead and cross off that $9.99. Are you ready for this? This one is on sale for $4.99. What? Now underneath that one is going to be the $4.49 package. This is what we call our standard kit. This is really going to be best for my ladies who are like, I am super busy, but I would love to have an extra stream of income coming in on the side. Great if you want to work the business online, you want to rock out on social media and make those easy sales. So. 30% commission, 30% personal discount, three toys in this one, and those same 12 liquid items cross off that 449. Right down to 19. And your biggest and best business option is going to be the premium kit. 1549. You are going to have nine premium toys. 12 liquid items and even some liquids for you to sell at your first couple of parties because I know y'all want to play tonight, all right? So having <laughs> items to take home is going to be awesome. This one has 45% personal discount and 45% commission. That is amazing. Go ahead and cross off that $15.49. That's on sale for $6.99. Mm -hmm. Now, like I said, I got into this for fun to get out of the house, and now I love that I have that flexibility to really create my own schedule, work around my family, but also contribute to the household income. Other reasons that ladies get into this business are paying for weddings, divorces, right, college, boobs, braces, paying off debt, a million different reasons, okay? But I actually want to answer some of the most popular questions I get. I'm going to give everybody two cards. And we're going to answer these all together. And at the end of this, you're actually going to have the opportunity to ask me any additional questions. So number one, who's got number one? I do. All right, read that for me. How much does it cost to join Pure Romance? So we have three different starter kits for three different budgets. And they're going to start at 219 the ones we just went over. Thank you. Number two. That's me. Oh, OK. What type of training will I get? Oh, I love the training. So typically, I'm going to have a new consultant with me, and she's going to shadow the party to get some hands-on experience. On top of that, you have online training. Y'all are super busy, so this is actually self-paced. It allows you to get that training when you have time to fit it in. On top of that, we're going to have in-person monthly meetings at my house, and I'm going to be available to you as your mentor, as someone who's going to be a personal cheerleader and guide you along the way throughout your journey with Pure Romance. Number three. Do I have to work a certain amount of time? Oh, I love this question. <laughs> no, there is no party requirement. You can work as little or as much as you'd like. This is a business for what you put into it is going to indic um, indicative of what you're gonna get out of it, all right? So the more you put in, the more you're gonna get out. If you're not working too much, you're not gonna get a whole lot out of it. Number four. How much money can I make with PR Romance? Oh, I love this. So on average, a brand new consultant is going to profit around $180 to $200 per in-home party. That's brand new cash in hand that night. Super easy. Number five. Uh, what are the perks for Pure Romance consultants? Ooh. What do you guys think the perks are? Discount. Yes, girl. <laughs> it is fun. I know. I needed something fun to do. Anything else you guys see? So I love that I really get to make my own schedule. Mm -hmm. Fabulous, right? I get to work when I want to. I can take vacations and not worry about it. I also didn't know that I liked to travel until it was free. So the free <laughs> trips are always fabulous, and I love that I constantly have income coming in from different resources, and we'll talk about that here in just a second. Number six. Uh, how soon can I start making money? Oh, I love this question. So most people are like in a need it now situation. So if you're ready to make money today, as soon as we get your kit ordered, you are actually going to have a free website for your first year. And the company 
sets it up for you. It's a professional website and you can start getting orders on there so you can make money today. Number seven. How does a pure romance consultant make money? Oh, I love this. There's actually four avenues that we make money off of. So number one, that free website. You are going to get a weekly commission check from our corporate office for all of those online orders. Number two, in-home parties. Just like this, I told y'all you're gonna make about $180 to $200 on your corporate average as far as what you are taking home that day and you get paid that day too. Number three, does anybody have a credit card where you've got that cash back bonus the next month? Y'all, we have retail sales bonuses. So when we hit certain quota for the month in our sales, we get up to 12.5% cash back, right? I only get like 5% back on my credit card and I'm like, don't tell me how much I spent, but by all <laughs> means, that's an extra 12.5% commission that you could earn every single month. Now, number four, it's going to be sharing the opportunity with other women. So our corporate office is actually going to pay you when you help spread the love and help change other women's lives. Number eight, what do you like most about your pure romance business? So honestly, what I like most about this business is something I never expected to find. When I started this, I was in a very deep depression. I was somebody who lacked a ton of self-confidence and I actually struggled in my relationship. Our communication was pretty awful. And so through this, I've actually learned how to better communicate with my partner. I've learned how to love myself, be very invested in my relationship, and my confidence has skyrocketed. And now I actually get to instill that confidence and self-love to every woman that I meet. And that is so amazing to have that kind of light that you can offer people. So that's probably my favorite thing is really truly helping every woman experience that love and self-worth that they need. And typically they don't get elsewhere. All right. Any other questions that you have about the business opportunity? No. You guys are good? Awesome. If you think of anything else, you are welcome to ask me in the shopping room. So take out those connection cards, the small cards I gave you at the beginning, and flip them over on the back side. Okay, we're gonna answer these all together across the top. Would you like to have your own girls' night? Yes, no, or maybe. Go ahead and circle that. Are you interested in more information about doing what I do? Yes, no, or maybe. Next question, who in this room would make a fantastic consultant? You can't choose me, I already have a job. So it can be you though, you can choose you. Number two is the most important question you'll answer. What did you enjoy most about tonight? Did you need a girls night with your friends? Were you here because there was food and wine? <laughs> did your vibrator break last night? And you're like, <laughs> ah, I need a new one. What did you enjoy most? And then number three is your loaded question. Tell me about yourself. Have you never had an orgasm? Are you a swinger? <laughs> Are you an ninja pole dancer? I don't know, that sounds really fun, doesn't it? You can tell me about your day job, whatever it is you care to share with me, it's perfect. Then I want you to tell me, what is your largest bill of the month? What do you hate to pay every month? Mine is student loans. Maybe it's your car payment, rent, mortgage, cell phone. Next question. If I showed up on your doorstep every single month with $800 and said you can't use it on your bills, what would you use it on? And then lastly, if I could teach you how to reduce that stress of that big bill that you hate and show you how to do more of what you'd want to do with that $800, would you like more information? Yes, no, or maybe. Now, over the next 30 days, I will help seven women start and run some amazing businesses. I don't know who they are and I don't know where I'll meet them, but if you'd like to be considered for one of those seven positions, put a star at the top of your card and I'll know to share more information with you. If who had, who, who put a star down? I'm just curious. Anybody? Yes. Okay. Y'all, I'm going to hand you my golden ticket. I don't want you to open it until you come into the shopping room with me. Okay. But there's a really nice bonus in there for you. Okay. So just hang on to that. There's one for you. All right. So if you guys have any other questions, you're welcome to ask me in the shopping room too. Ladies, let's give it up one more time for our beautiful hostess. Thank you so much for coming. Not only does she get a round of applause, but she actually has a gift. So I put together this cute little gift for you. 
Yes. Thank you. You are so welcome. So I actually gave you one of my favorite products because, you know, I just wanted to make sure that you have, oh, I'm going to have that sexy skin. All right, ladies, last thing, go ahead and look at your tickets, all right? Make sure you got your tickets out and ready. We are going to pull a winner, all right? We're going to figure out who's going to win because I've got a little gift for you in the shopping room. All right, take them out, look at them. We're going to go with the last three digits. You ready? Last three digits are eight, three, zero. <laughs> Is it? It's from your orgasm. Yeah. Your orgasm got you the ticket. All right, you hang My on. Mental You're. <laughs> it's fine. I knew where you were going. I can't. I can't vibrate your brain though. So I was like, well, yeah, but I can't help you there. Hang on to your winners. I'm gonna collect all the non-winners. So to wrap things up completely, I do have lots of lingerie for y'all to try. No, hang on to the winner. Yep, I'll take out the other ones. So I've got lots of lingerie for y'all to try on. Please. Um, Make sure that you are trying, the. if you try the bottoms on, there's something underneath. All right, I said, I know you said no panties, right. so right over the jeans, girl. All right. Um, also, three options of how we're going to spoil our hostess tonight. One, chop your face off. The more orgasms that you get tonight, the more she gets for free, okay? And then number two, get everything that you need tonight, must have, can't live without. Save the rest and have your own girls night because you're going to get that at a lovely discount. Mm -hmm. Number three, grab one of those new consultant starter kits. Whatever that percentage was, you are going to now be able to shop with that discount, which is pretty freaking cool. Right? Yeah. Right? Did you guys have a great time tonight? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. Thank you again, and I can't wait to see you in the shopping room. Thank you. Thank you.